Hey guys, my name is Lenny and this is my Ashe gameplay. I'm gonna be playing a normal game with uh, the role team against us. I've tried recording it for a few times with fraps and it just didn't work out. It was either laggy or the game crashed for some reason. So I'm playing with Darius on the bottom lane. That's kinda good setup even though uh, we both need you know, minion kills and it's actually gonna be hard for it should be harder for me to get um, my CS up like minion kills but judging from my auto attacking lane mate um, it's gonna be pretty easy as he has no clue about last hitting and um, it's gonna be pretty easy to gank mid as um, they are gonna be under leveled so we got Ziggs against us, so far he haven't done anything, he's just missing kinda ob ob obvious, uh... yeah that was really really big miss and such mistakes can really show that um, he's unexperienced and he's probably gonna die a lot. For some reason Darius is pushing even though Zix is hugging the tower. Um, right now the best way to handle this in my opinion will be to separate Zix from our minions so he don't get any experience. But Darius is doing the exact, op exact opposite even though... Um, hey 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 don't get hit. Um, wow really? So they got two people on the mid lane and they switched one from the top lane to the bottom um, to hold it down here. These guys are really stubborn probably and pretty much stupid um, I guess. I don't really get what uh, Darius is trying to achieve here. He should be going back um, and healing as they can burst him down if they focus him. And they really should go for the kill. Yeah, they are going for the kill. Luckily, um, he got me as the backup and we managed to take down at least one of them. And it seems like I'll be able to slow Ahri one more time. Yeah, cool. And I can flash and finish her off. Easy kill there and first blood for our team. That's really neat. Um, you can say it's a normal game just uh, by the time and the number of kills, total kills. In more experienced, well in more more interesting matches uh, you don't see that much kills. Um, if uh, players are more experienced they are more kill careful and they actually got some survivability. So they don't die that often and Usually, it's not unusual to see the first blood on um, 10th, even 20th minute. Although I haven't seen a game won without um, spilling a blood, but I guess it's possible. Um, so we are pushing back and forth. Uh, Darius is just offering his um, body to get hit by the skill shots they got for is is really his movement is really bad like really really bad he's just running around doing nothing and letting, letting them um, guide him luckily they are not uh, good at it so we are not losing that much arc that was bad hit for me I'm still watching mid lane, um, just in case uh, there's opening for a gank. Right now they are at uh, 500 and 600 HPs and Katarana is the same, so no real opening for me uh, to gank. Especially as I don't have my <coughs> first item, well, my first damage item. I still need 200 more for the BF sword. Top is overpushed. 
but they are doing a really good job and Malfoy is gonna go down. Um, in the meantime we are still pushing back and forth and I got my ultimate right now but my teammate is really low and he has actually no idea what's, what he's doing so I cannot use him to attack them. And it seems like um, Ezreal from the top lane missed, bar missed uh, middle and hit bottom accidentally. And if he was actually aiming at bottom, good job Ezreal, but I don't think so. Darius again, um, for no real reason, letting them uh, take him down. I guess he wanted to go for the kill, but uh, he didn't realize that by moving towards them, He's gonna scare them. If you wanna lure someone into a trap and finish him off, you don't really want to be um, walking towards him. You actually want him to feel confident and um, when he's gonna make his move towards you, you just can take advantage of that and get him. Movement is really fundamental in this game and um, a lot of people at this level have no clue about it. Like right now, they are offering themselves from this brush this way. So it's an easy kill for me as I got my critical chance uh, load up, loaded up. For some reason I wanted Katarina to go back and she's still on the lane so I, I'm thinking um, is she baiting is she trying to bait uh, Ezreal she's actually doing nothing she was just standing there walking around letting him um, damage her and ignite her so I'm trying at least to avenge her but I'm um, trying to run away as I have seen that Ezreal would um, survive but Ziggs got this um, annoying ability and that's the end of me. But in the meantime Ziggs um, left his lane and Darius is gonna go for the kill. <laughs> so he took the kill on me and he killed his own partner here as she couldn't really stand Darius. Not really because of um, of Darius, but because of her skill. I'm glad that mid lane is still standing. I mean, if you're playing 2v1 on mid lane, um, you really should push it or at least uh, keep your opponent um, zoned out. That means um, not getting any experience and gold. But hey, um, they wanted to flame, rage and whatever and have a hard time playing against Katarina, so they got it. Um, I got some free time on the lane, so I can grab a few minimum kills, that's good for me. And I might even try to go for the kill on Ahri, as she's playing real bad, at least in my opinion. Like right now she's still standing in my range. I can even waste my ultimate, I don't care, as I can finish her off. I guess this was the first time I actually um, didn't expect the movement of my opponent precisely. Usually you want to run away from um, Ashe, so she cannot uh, keep you slowed. Um, she might have been thinking about killing me. I guess that was the reason why she came back and died like... Hmm, whatever. Darius is gonna go for some sort of gank. And he actually pulled it off. Oh. It kinda lagged for him there. <laughs> cool, he got the kill. Um. Katarina, wow really she's uh, losing the world game and then she goes for suicide rush. At least uh, I think she pulled it off, I think she killed someone. 
and it probably was Ezreal, yeah. Now there's a gang going on, probably, but they are not really working together. Oh, that's that's a big mistake. There was a kill. Um, if Ezreal and Morda pushed together, they could have uh, killed Lux. I don't know why. Um, they didn't work together, and I'm not really sure why Morda was uh, chasing Ari even. Even though he knew that he cannot really kill her um, because of her ultimate. And. Wow, really? They killed someone? <laughs> oh, that's. Ziggs getting free kills, cool. I'm always glad when someone is feeding my lane. Especially when it's my lane mate. Not much happening here. Mid lane still fighting. I'm taking advantage of my own team right now. As I'm pretty confident that uh, Katarina can defend mid lane with ease and I can um, get myself stronger in the meantime. I really need my Infinity Edge, at least. Infinity Edge and um, Vampire Acceptor is the core of my build. Right now I just wanted to make sure that uh, Malphi is not gonna ultimate me and take me down. I was really surprised that uh, he wasn't actually taking any damage from me. I guess um, it's kind of higher armor than I expected. Since the last few patches, um, melee characters were... I think they got all boost in magic resist and armor. At least they felt like that to me. It felt like it. Mm -hmm. Did he miss his ultimate? Again? <laughs> cool. So, um, Morde is taking unnecessary damage. And it's uh, 3v2. Uh, they actually could have killed Morde. And for some reason he came back and offered his life again. <laughs> At least he didn't die. Wow, really? <laughs> so, um, we switched lanes and Katarina is farming bottom, I'm farming top lane. I still don't have enough gold for Infinity Edge. And I'm really expecting someone to gank me. As right now I feel that uh, me and Darius are... Wow, Ezreal 6 kills, cool. I guess that's why they are sticking um, on the mid lane. They are trying to control um, Ezreal. And right now it's obvious gank on me. Yeah, I don't see three people. And that usually means they are going for either for you, like here, or for someone else who's pushing. So, um, Ezreal's gonna die probably. Yeah. He's a free kill. I even made, made sure that I can reach Zix in time to slow him and finish him off as well. Um, achieving double kill. Pretty easy double kill. I mean, I have done literally nothing. They just offered me the double kill. So I got um, infinite edge, finally, and let's see what I'm gonna do, hmm, oh yeah, I was watching Ezreal and he changed direction, um, originally he was going for the top lane, but then he switched and went for the mid lane, so I uh, went instead of him. To the top and I'm gonna farm some more. Probably get the Vampire Acceptor or even more damage. As my team seem to be handling it quite well until now. Yeah, that's 
But even if I was there, I wouldn't be able to do much. As Morde died to Malphite's ultimate, um, Darius died to Luxus um, ultimate. Oh, there are a lot of dead bodies in here. So how, ma how many uh, can I kill? One. Two. Oh, Malphite is doing pretty decent damage. Oh boy, this could end badly. Oh, oh, uh, three. Oh, come on, more Malphite. Oh yeah. <laughs> so um, it wasn't really Penta, as I think uh, one of them died here, and I had nothing to do with that. I guess it was Zix or Ahri. Yeah, I think it was Ahri. Not much happening, I'm gonna speed this up. Morde is trying to pull off 1v4. Hopefully not. <laughs> I don't know, there's no reason for him to stand here. Either farm and leave. Or leave straight away. If there are 5 uh, enemies walking around and no one is on lanes. That usually means that they are uh, jungling, well, well, clearing their jungle. And again, Morde is out of his position for no apparent reason, doing nothing. He's not helping the team, he's just watching people die. And I'm trying to fight Malphite, who attacked me, apparently. Yeah, here's the ultimate, and bye bye I was actually uh, happy about killing Malphite as his pretty tough and he was getting cocky running around the map like a boss so someone had to take him down not much happening here I mean uh, look at these people they are just clueless um, both waiting for the next wave to come even though there's wall jungle to be cleared out. Morde can take out raids in like 2-3 hits. I guess the same could uh, work for Katarina with a little bit more hits. At least they could uh, secure blue for someone or red or dragon. Oh, Katarina going for a suicide rush again. Hopefully I'll be there on time, well in time to save her butt and it seems like yeah that's gonna be kill for me as I got flash ready if it was anyone else I wouldn't waste my flash just for this kill but hey it was small fight so I had to use it and kill him and I think I'm gonna give a kill to one of my teammates yeah I knew I wouldn't be able to reach them in time to kill them, but I really wanted to kill someone, so I helped one of, one of my teammates to a kill. <laughs> they are really reckless. But they are lucky that uh, Darius has no clue on how to use his grab. And it seems like Katarina. Yeah, just killed herself and Ezreal for the same for the same reason killed himself and that reason is no reason at all and again they are just dying for no apparent reason and right now I know I'm screwed that um, I should have back uh, sooner and so I'm gonna try to kill at least... Oh, that was close. Um, usually when Ahri is... When fresh Ahri is chasing you, and by fresh I mean she got her ultimate. 
or at least flash, um, you know that you're gonna die as she can outrun you unless you're uh, Master Ye or whatever. And just judging from my team's movement, I should have known that they are gonna die. So I could have survived that. That was my mistake. Um, is real wasting his ultimate. So we got uh, four people running around, doing nothing, and finally they realized that there is this special creature in here, and it's called a dragon. Finally they are going to kill it. Yay! I would actually expect uh, Darius or Morde to go and tank it uh, much sooner. And Morde is not even helping them. Um, whatever. At least we got a dragon and I got uh, some, some more CS. And as I can see, I even boosted my E to outfarm my opponents uh, sooner. I was uh, really intrigued uh, here. I wanted to kill someone, but when I saw Ezreal coming in with uh, both buffs, I just had to back up, back off. And it seems like Murder is having trouble, so he popped his ultimate and ignite and just ran. The usual strategy. And he actually nearly killed him, wow. So I got my ultimate ready, but I'm not entirely sure what's gonna happen. And I think I might be able to hit him. Right now Zix know, knows about me and he probably just realized that he's gonna die. Yeah. Oh yeah. And she just had to try it. That's what I call trolling. Trying to ki um, kill steal someone even though uh, the person, the killer, the hunter is, uh, was actually helping you throughout the game. That's just sick and I don't like such people. I like to help people, I like to help my teammates, but when they try to backstab me, uh, I'm gonna just stop helping and I'll actually try to um, pay it back. More dead defending or farming again, whatever. So he picked up uh, blue and he's not making use of it. He's just farming. That's sad. Oh, this was sad as well. I could have got a kill. And it seems like it's gonna be... Yeah. He made the mistake of uh, not going straight for this part of the jungle. And that's what I've been uh, talking about earlier. Movement is real fundamental. You make one more, one wrong step and you're dead. I guess it's like in American football. With the exception of not actually being killed by anyone. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> and again, um... One wrong step and she's dead. I'm trying to push them off so my teammates can finish off the inhibitor. But when I saw that they don't really have any damage, um, I came back to help them and I just flashed into an ultimate, that's cool. Now that was real pro. <laughs> um, let's get back to the time when we were pushing here. Um, Morde and Darius should actually go and push back our enemies, at least try to. 
I mean, they would get some damage, but they would offer me some time, well, buy me some time, and I would have finished off the inhibitor sooner. Um, more they're going for his usual ultimate ignite and hope for the best, and he survived with his teammate's help. That's real low strategy. It's working, I know, but... You really should play it safer. It's like um, recklessly playing Malzahar and ultimating anyone um, if you feel in danger. Wasting your ultimate like that is kinda bad. But so far there wasn't any real team fight where we could take advantage of his ghost so I don't mind I don't care right now I'm trying to actually avoid my team and survive as my teammates tend to die a lot and when they die I die as um, carry and I'm pretty easy target I mean I got only 2.2k health and that can go down in an instant Right now I'm trying to lure Lux just a little bit for Darius to get in, but for some reason he stopped and let her escape. And right now I realized that Katarina is going for a suicide rush again, and that I have to help her somehow. But I cannot, I, I cannot reach her, so at least I worried them. And Darius went for a suicide rush, and Mord is hopefully gonna survive long enough to help me out and again they are just rushing our enemies right now we could actually push this and finish the game but I think I'm gonna stick to my plan and slowly uh, destroy both inhibitors and get some more kills just for the fun Right now I'm waiting for someone to um, step into my range and die. Um, right now it's a possibility... Oh no. Oh no. At least I switch target to... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> nice. So I nearly took out three people. Um, just in time for them to kill me, that's sad. And again, it's all about movement, it's all about baiting your opponent into a suicide rush like um, Ahri showed. And I don't really get it, why Darius get back there. And if Malphite pursued, he would have killed Darius. Oh, well, I'm gonna pause the video here for a moment. Please don't mind the background sound, my Zelda just got home. Um, where were we? <laughs> so um, we are actually winning and it's obviously a normal game as it takes quite long with a lot of kills. And I think I'm gonna go for Warmox, oh yeah. Just because I can. Small fights. Wow, what's he really doing here? Oh, <laughs> bad move, real bad move. I'm gonna speed things up and again, and hopefully, we'll see some final action. It seems like this is the final push. And again, the movement is fundamental. Well, he really helped with the flash and so on. And right now I could have finished him off with my ultimate, but I left the kill um, for Morde. And I even saved Katarina um, by offering my own body to jump on. I'm really glad when I can help. 
Although I should have remembered that she tried to kill steal one of my kills and I should have left her to her death. Whatever, my bad, my memory. Um, Zix desperately trying to do anything. Oh boy. Um, yeah, this is the end. Boom, boom, boom. And I'm actually trying to kill Zix, um, even in Fountain. Good game, um, it was fun. And hopefully, I'm gonna go um, and play Ashe in ranked. See ya.